then there was a man threatening to shoot people with a gun in his hand. It's just like a rifle or whatever. The 911 call placed from inside the Westchester Walmart sounds disturbing. According to one of the cost, uh, you know, the employee, he just threatening, you know, he just he said he's a dangerous man. He is 70-year-old Milton Baum. The rifle, a BB gun, Baum says he previously bought at Walmart for his grandson. So I brought it home, took it out of the box, and I went. He couldn't cock it, so he returned to Walmart. He said he left the gun in his car. I said, look, I bought this defective BB gun. I'd like to return it. Well, this guy is uh, giving me attitude. And I said, sir, I don't know how much common sense you have. I said, you know who you remind me of? The hall monitor in high school. A comment that didn't go over well with that employee. Baum says another staff member was willing to work with him and told him to go get the gun and bring it in. That's when Baum says the incident blew up. According to court documents, an employee reported Baum threatened to shoot someone, and that employee feared for himself and others. It's a BB gun. It doesn't have a firing pin. It doesn't have bullets in it. Did you threaten anyone? No. Baum was arrested. He says this was the first time he's been locked up in 70 years. He's charged with inducing panic, menacing, and aggravated menacing. He says he was wrongfully charged. Well, yeah. Plus, it's costing me $1,500. $1,500 because Baum says he now has to pay for an attorney. Now, Walmart did release a statement late this afternoon saying, we applaud the quick actions of our associates and are thankful that no one was injured. We appreciate the swift response of the Westchester Police Department and will refer additional questions to them. I did reach out to the Westchester Police Department, but was told no one was available for comment. Reporting live tonight in Westchester, Karen Johnson, WLWT News 5.